Hey everyone, so as Bitcoin finally become mainstream, Bitcoin has entered into its seventh bullish cycle from an historical context, according to a new report published by Pentera Capital. According to a new report published by Pentera Capital, which takes an historical view of past cycles in terms of length and returns, Pentera Capital believes this could be the bottom. And this prediction isn't just coming from some social media clown or uninformed newbie. Pantera has $4.1 billion in assets under management, 100 venture investments, 110 early stage token investments, and three fund strategies. They've invested through four crypto winters or boom bust cycles previously. In short, these guys know what the heck they're talking about. Now let's take a look at Pantera Capital's findings. With the November 2021 to November 2022 top to bottom decline in Bitcoin is 77% and lasting 376 days, those numbers align with historical norms of six previous bust periods. Bitcoin's 77% decline has already surpassed the historical median decline of 73% and weighted mean of 68%. In case you didn't know, the weighted mean takes into account the importance or frequency of each value in the data set by multiplying each value by a weight and then dividing the sum of all the weighted values by the sum of all the weights. The November 21-22 bear market also surpassed historical norms in terms of length, with median elapsed time of 307 days and weighted mean of 256 days. So the recent Bitcoin bear was both deeper and longer than the prior six bear markets on average. Furthermore, the historical data based on prior Bitcoin bear markets suggests the current bull market may be just getting started. According to the report, Bitcoin price had only increased about 2x off the lows versus an historical norm of 15x and weighted mean of 4x. So historically speaking, Bitcoin's bottom move has more to run. All this data prompted Pantera Capital CEO Dan Moorhead to conclude, quote, I think we're done with that and beginning to grind higher. I believe that blockchain assets have seen the lows and that we're in the next bull market cycle, regardless of what happens in the interest rate sensitive asset classes. That's a reassuring statement, but can we trust it? Time will only tell. If you wanna learn more on where Bitcoin is going, then leave a comment below and make sure to share this video with your network. Click on that bell for all notifications and make sure to subscribe to our channel because we would not be here without you. Thanks for watching everyone.